Yo, what's good, man? What's good? Yo, we back again with another banger for the 20th time, man. This month going crazy in May. May all year, man. Y'all, as you know, my birthday is tomorrow, so I'm I don't know if I'm gonna be upload. I want to upload tomorrow, but I don't know what I'm gonna be doing. But hey, that's just for y'all to know. I ain't that's you know, don't think of it nothing. That's just for y'all to know. Heads up. So anyway, we got we in the stage today. We in the stage. We rocking out in the stage. I'm doing my thing. So I'm rocking out with me on my new bad setup. It's it's not that it's not that uh it's not that different. But y'all been asking me what badges I have. So I'm you know I'm gonna show y'all. I think I showed y'all in patch 12 yet the, the shooting badges I'm rocking with. So I'm gonna just show y'all these shooting badges. The ones that raised my green window. Honestly, I'm just gonna show you all the ones that raise my green window and why I run it. It's certain badges in the game that raise your green window to a certain point. You know, I'm not talking about the badges that just help you make shots, standing shots, like catch and shoot or corner specialists, you know, flexible release. They just help you make shots. They don't boost anything. You know, catch and shoot does boost, but I'm talking about just off the dribble getting your own shots. And no difficult shots and will not be in this one because don't have enough shooting badges for it. I mean shooting bad upgrades in. And it's not see oh my god. Just admire that green right there, man. That's the dead eye shot. That's a Hall of Fame dead eye shot. Just peep that. That's why y'all should be running that Hall of Fame dead eye. You get shots like that to fall. That's why I know like I can shoot certain shots because I have Hall of Fame dead eye. It's just certain shots like that you have to take with dead eye. And that's really what I found out. That's a that's a late contest. You get that off. And this is not even my shooting build. And I'm shooting like this. This is my scoring machine. If I have my playmaking shot creator playing at the stage, I'm probably gonna play with my playmaking shot creator at the stage more because he does have a higher three. And that's a higher green window to green, low key. <laughs> I'm gonna need that. So anyway, we at the stage going crazy, man. You see, I'm rocking with my all oh, these shooting badges, you all oh, everything. So anyway, what was I saying? Uh, catch and shoot. I was, you know, badges like that. They're good, but I want to show y'all the badges that get it done off the dribble, like how I'm playing. I don't, I'm not gonna get too many catch and shoots, so I'm gonna show y'all how we doing without it. See, see, we probably play defense right here. He's abusing the screen. It's no problem. He still got his meter off in May. Yo, dude, this literally like June, July, August. It's like four more months of this game and you got your meter on, my dude. Four more months. We should be getting 2K21 news around this next month or this month or next month. It's about that time, y'all. You know, hey, hey, this quarantine, this quarantine thing took a lot of time, but it's about to be summertime. Y'all about to be just out of school for the whole year. It, it took that long, I'm telling you. <clears throat> but anyway, that's not the point, you know. We, we still gonna be rocking either way. We still gonna be doing our thing either way, all the way through. Till 2K21 drop, we gonna be dropping news and everything. So make sure y'all leave out for that. We definitely gonna be dropping them. Uh, When that prelude drop, when that 2K21 prelude drop, we gonna be on that too. So make sure y'all stay tuned for those, man. We gotta always stay tuned. So after past 12, you know, I don't think a lot of badges got nerfed, but you always want to, if you're just my build, yo, you always want to have badges that's going to help you create your own shot. Especially if you're the main, the main guard and don't have a lot of playmakers to help you out. You're going to want to put the badges like uh, Deadeye, Green Machine, all them badges on, you know, to help you out. It's, it's not all the time you're going to get a playmaker like I have on my team who I can give the ball to and create something for me. So y'all do need to, I'm going to show y'all all the badges I run with to create space and get your shot off. So it's not going to be no, um, it's not going to be no catch and shoot. It's not going to be no corner specialist. It's not, it's not going to be nothing like that. Nothing too crazy. Not no hot start. Nothing like that. Cause you know, hot start is not good. I don't like it, but you see, we just, you see we how we creating our space and I'm going to talk about that clutch shooter and all that. After, the, after this game, I'm going to show you all the badges that I'm rocking with. You see, we just, just cleanse this guy real quick. He still has his meter on. Nobody takes him serious. I can just low key let him shoot. But, you know, this is, we, we just we just have to clamp up. I have to practice my defense low key. You know, we all not good at for certain things. You know, we got to get better. 
I'm not saying I'm the best, but look, look at this. Look, I think he tried to pull that or pass it to me. I don't know. But anyway, past 12, only the thing that it did was I think it increased to shoot the, the green windows a little bit. That's what I heard. So that's why I'm going to show you all badges that increase your green window even more to be shooting. Because I wasn't hitting those dead eye shots. I was not hitting those dead eye shots uh, pre patch 12. I wasn't hitting those dead eye shots like that. And now patch 12, I think it probably boosted a lot of contested shots to go in. Like dead eye and all that. <laughs> it's a blessing. It's a blessing in disguise, low key. But we're not even here to talk about that. So I'm going to go ahead and show you all these badges. And I'm going to just talk about each and every one. So you see right here, we're rocking um, that clutch shooter on bronze, that dead eye that green machine hot zone hunter uh range extender and the newest poly edition we're gonna have quick draw on gold now i have my reasons for having quick draw on gold it's because on this build i already have a fast jump shot base in dwayne wade so that's why i i toned it down a little bit just so i can have that that more control over my jump shot see what well, you can have hall of fame quick draw right this is what a lot of y'all ask me a lot of y'all ask me do i have hall of fame quick draw or gold quick draw yes hall of fame quick draw is good but if you want to have that control over your character that can that that control over your jump shot animations because some animation some jump shot animations are very different than the ones that they normally give you sometimes they give you a gather jump shot you have to know how to control that with faster bases, it, it's sometimes un unpredictable what animation they give you. That's why I roll with Gold Quick Draw for this. Just because it's a very fast base. It's a very fast base. With other jump shots, I'm going to probably switch it to Hall of Fame. And you know, when I have Gold Quick Draw, I could run that extra badge on bronze, which I put it on Clutch Shooter. Now, you've seen that, uh, that shot I hit when it was like 18, 18, uh, 15 or something? No, it was 15. 15 13 i don't know to bring it to 18 but clutch shooter always brings that it always boosts your shot at the late the last points of the game now clutch shooter only comes in towards like when your team has 15 or something it does work in park because y'all definitely just seen it in the stage it does work even though it says it doesn't work in park it does work in park and it's a very good badge to have because when you're in those late games and you need shots to fall you're the one to go to because you have that badge you have that badge on you have that badge on whatever tier as long as you have it on bronze i think you're good you see it pop it on bronze it gives you that little boost you'll be straight that's a this a clutch shooter is a very good badge to have very underrated and i don't know how people don't use it it's a very very good badge i have to say now dead eye you see him you see me get those dead eye shots off on that guy you see me go crazy with the dead eye it's nothing new uh dead eye always been a good badge to have especially after patch 12 because it got that buff you seen it you as long as you get that little space you could pull up and you have to be dead eye you have to be on your stuff because if you time that shot off you will miss it so you have to time it right as long as you get open and get a little bit of space you could pull hall of fame dot i go put it on hall of fame now green machine you don't necessarily have to run that on um gold i mean hall of fame i just do it just because of that having that extra boost to green but a lot of people say you don't even need green machine i agree with them you don't really need it but i just love to have it to have it and you know the rest uh range setting you already know about range setting i'm not gonna go into that Hazel Hunter always been a good badge in the game. It always been that number one badge, go-to shooting badge to always put on your character. If you don't have Hot Zone Hunter and you have Hot Zones, I don't know what you're doing. It, it literally, it's literally a badge to boost your jump shot just for having hot, hot spots. It's that OP. Now, I always love Hot Zone Hunter. I always kept it on since the first pass. You see me getting that dead eye shot. That's how I that's how I see that I got boosted this year because you see he got the late contest and I just pulled. I recognize he you know, he wasn't there. Even though it doesn't pop up, Dead Eye's not one of those badges that pop up all the time, but you know they working. You know they're working. So all you have to do you see you see how to use it. I'm showing you how to use it. Oh my god, look at the dunk. He was very late for that contest. I pulled and he wasn't on defender. 
he wasn't a two-way enough and so that's a good pull right there that's a good that's an excellent pull so you see we're rock, um pulling down the board and also that green machine helps too a lot even though i said you don't need it it does help your your um green green percentage go up it doesn't help your green percentage go you see i'm pulling another one i think that was a little bit late but it still went down because of that hot zone hunter helps you make more whites too low key helps you make way more whites it's just a, it's just a straight good bat now all of these badges come in dead eye hot zone hunter and uh green machine they all come together to they all stack together to raise your green window a significant amount and that's why I need y'all to pay attention because some of these badges that you'll have don't you don't need like hot start you don't need that badge to raise your green percentage it's certain badges that'll help you way more in the game that you t should take advantage of now if I could take any badge away any badge points away I'll probably take away from green machine and use it on clutch shooter more because I believe clutch shooter raises your green percent even more you see I got that another dead eye shot that's another dead eye shot you see the boost that I got. The Dead Eye is a very good badge after patch 12. It's very underrated. And I'm probably going to keep that badge on Hall of Fame just because of the shots I'm greening with it on. You know, quick pull up with my Hezzy. Even dribble moves can uh, help you get your shot off even faster. Like Pro 3 Hesitation helps me get my shot off way faster for that Dead Eye to activate. That Dead Eye on uh, Hall of Fame is nothing to play around. That, that's a real good badge right there after patch 12. It very underrated. I don't think that I've been doing that since patch one. It hasn't been going crazy like that. But now after patch 12, it's going extra crazy. And I highly suggest you guys to rock that on Hall of Fame. Oh my God, that badge is so OP. All them badges come together and help you green your shot. That's another that I shot just because he was there late. You see, I got that little bit of space and pulled up in his mouth. He couldn't even do nothing. As long as I have that little bit of space and I'm on point with my timing, that I it's going to work. It's going to come in. It's going to do its thing. And just because it's a dead eye shot, it raises your green window. Look at another that another dead eye shot. Just because he he had that late contest, that I raised your green window. Now, if it wasn't a dead eye shot, it'd be just a regular uh, hot zone 100 green machine sh shot and clutch shooter because it's late in the game. It don't matter if the team is close to you or not. If you, you could be blowing them out, that clutch shooter still gonna come in late game. That's why. I, that's what I love about it. That's what I love about it. So anyway, I'm gonna give y'all. I'm gonna show y'all these badges one more time at the end. You know, just just in case for the people that want to skip to the end. Hey, it's all love. I'm gonna just show you again right here and give y'all the summary of what's going on. So I don't, I don't even like making my videos this long, but hey, I was really going into it this this video. Excuse me for that. So Dead Eye, 10 out of 10, yo, that's a crazy badge after past 12 because it raised your green window significantly just for a late contest. Guys, 100 always been a solid badge. You gotta keep that one. Green Machine is probably demoting. It's probably going down in value. That's why I wouldn't run in the Hall of Fame. But you know me just for the sake of this video. And just because like I had it on all year. And it wouldn't feel right if I didn't have it on Hall of Fame. It's kind of a, a placebo effect when you come to me. But you do not need to have a green window. I mean a green machine on Hall of Fame if you don't want to. It's just my personal preference. And if I don't run green machine on Hall of Fame. I'm definitely putting it on clutch shooter to give me even more boost during that late game situations to knock down shots. It probably works as good as clutch shooter anyway. But you know, green green machine works through, throughout the whole game. Clutch shooter only works probably around uh 15, 15 when your team scores 15 and up. But you know, that's a very good badge to have, and you know. So anyway, I'm gonna cut a video before it gets too long because I gotta render it. Uh make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe if you knew. And do all that good things. And I'ma see y'all in my next video. Peace. Make sure y'all stay safe.